Hi, I'm Varun and I'm part of this amazing community called Glow. I'm an engineer and I've always been fascinated by Elon Musk and his ventures. The latest topic I have been pondering upon is Neuralink. Neuralink is an initiative by one of the greatest minds of the century, Elon Musk. This is the next thing he is looking out for and I must say, this doesn't disappoint you in terms of futuristic thinking and creativity. Well, to say in simple terms, what Musk is trying to achieve here with Neuralink is he simply wants to reverse engineer a brain. In engineer's terms, he is looking to create a BMI or a brain machine interface. What this essentially does is it helps in fighting neurological disorders and restoring functionalities such as sensory and motor functions. Neuralink has grown a lot since Musk has acquired it and recently he even went through a different kind of recruitment process. Few weeks ago, Musk went on to the bigger tiers after working at Neuralink for over two years. He didn't do this for popularity or as a means of getting the name up. But he did that to raise awareness about why this is necessary. There were two main highlights of this program. He didn't have a fully functioning prototype of the product but got people to understand what this is and why we need Neuralink. And then the second, this was the, me this was the means to open an open recruitment. He was ready to accept any papers, applications, conferences on this topic just to widen the scale. This could only be pulled off because it is Elon Musk that did it. Now, I'll just tell you the basic underlying operations that Neuralink can pull off and help in bringing about a better future. It can be used to fight neurological disorders. It can be used to perform sensory and motor op operations. This means a person with a prosthetic arm will no longer feel that he is handicapped. It won't be a mere extension of his decapitated arm, but his arm itself. Basically, if his arms are covered, you'll never know that it is a prosthetic arm. The way this works and has to be installed is quite a tedious process at the moment. A specific fiber containing 3072 electrodes across 96 rows will be etched onto the brain which works as an antenna. The Brain waves are modulated, selectively chosen to relevant information, sent across to a receiver antenna, demodulated again and transduced to electrical signals to a lengthy machine handle the process. So, it basically works like any other machine to machine communication device. The only change here being the neural signals are converted to electrical signals, hence the brain to machine interface. This is a promising piece of tech coming up in the near future and it's Musk. Definitely a winner in my opinion. If you want to know the answer and ask more questions, visit the website glow.community and join the movement at hashtag glow with us. Thank you.